Palestinians from all around the world are outraged after seeing this video. The video shows a Palestinian student dancing while holding the Israeli flag. The video was recorded at the sixth grade graduation ceremony at the Rosary Sisters or Madrasat Rahbat al Wardiya school in Jerusalem. The principal of the school came out and defended the performance by saying that it simply depicts conflicts from all around the world, like the US and Korea, like Russia and Ukraine. And this outraged the parents present even more because she was comparing Israel to legitimate countries simply in conflict with other countries, which is not the truth. Israel is a Western colonial project that is literally ethnically cleansing and taking place of another people. This isn't the first time that this school has been problematic. In 2014, the school witnessed protests after preventing Muslim students from wearing their hijab during their graduation ceremony. Then in 2022, this school received a grant of 1 million shekels from the Israeli government to implement Israeli curriculum. And this brings us to the root cause of everything that's happening, the Judaization of the Palestinian educational system. And this goes way back to 1967 when Israel illegally occupied Jerusalem. And at that time, they tried to enforce Israeli curriculum on Arab Palestinian students. How did the students and the parents and the teachers respond? They organized a strike that completely deterred Israeli plans. In 2018, however, Israel put a strategic plan in order to get rid of Palestinian curriculum. Because they are illegally occupying Jerusalem, they hold unlimited power over these schools. And so if a school refuses to integrate the Israeli curriculum, they are threatened with being shut down, having their license revoked, and having all aid cut off. On the other hand, they incentivize schools to incorporate Israeli curriculum by offering millions in financial aid. Just in recent years, over 30 new schools have been built in East Jerusalem by the Israeli government. They spent hundreds of millions of dollars to build these schools that include the most modern art, music, technology programs. The only catch? These schools have Israeli curriculum. So what's the big deal, you might ask? So what? Israeli curriculum completely purges the term Palestine as well as the Palestinian flag. Any references to Al-Aqsa Mosque are completely erased. This is a dangerous ploy to erase Palestinian history, national and religious identity. And it's super dangerous because it targets unaware children. We need to help and support Palestinian schools and teachers who are in this war against Israeli oppression to maintain their Palestinian educational systems. And Israel might think that it's winning this war when seeing videos like this. But the fact is so many Palestinian entities came out and condemned what happened, including the Palestinian Ministry of Education and the Christian National Assembly. But more importantly was how the parents reacted after this event, proving that just like in 1967, Palestinians will continue to resist Israeli occupation. Free Palestine.